There we go, game one. Hello and welcome to the Ball Plays What Is To Be Our Christian Japan. Speedrun attempt. Start as whichever daimyo you like. Own all of Japan. Oh, they got a 10 shock roll. Yeah, that doesn't help either. Uh, and convert it all to Catholic. Every single province. Well, one of the Christian faiths. Doesn't have to be Catholic. Could be Orthodox. I think so. Yeah, could be Orthodox. Could be Coptic if you really wanted. Uh, ready, steady, and cook. Okay, we know the opening because we were doing this yesterday for Chrysanthemum Throne. It is get rid of Mr. Horsey. Sell off our boat. Eh. Set up our estates. You and you. 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 Actually, that's not one that I wanted, but whatever. That one. Happiness. That one. That one. Missionary yoink. Yep, I guess we're going with get our freedom. Did that get me enough to... Nope, it did not. Uh, missionary, no, no. It's these. These come here. You go there. We go get our alliances. Thankfully, he's still friendly. Same with you. Mm, he's walking this way. No, gather here. Roll our starting leader. Much better. We should set our merchant to love mode. Okay, now let's look at alliances. He has too many alliances this time. What about you? You only have one alliance, which is a little bit tempting. The trouble is they'll be able to block the crossing. What about you? He only has one alliance and we can crush him. Done. And his friend has no friends. Mm, wait for the others. Chase. Okay. Cancel. I need you. Fine. You're not going to behave sensibly. Ask for... I don't need access in you. I should be able to just walk here. Good. One of you go here. The other one of you go there. And all should be well and right with the world. Teleport the leader to here because it's where there's actually going to be a fight. Smush. Beautiful. <sighs> we are going to need to go over the force limit for sieging down this province. There's no ands, ifs, or buts about that, so do that. Although, actually, we don't need it yet. I might as well wait until this is done. We need to make our boss happy with us so that he doesn't try and eat our face. We need to find out where our other merchant is and what they are doing. Mm, this influences everyone that I need it to. So actually, the other one can stay on um, extra extra trade power mode. Other than that, what do we want? Does the face taste good? Well, that's a question we're going to have to ask Ashikaga. Does our face taste good? I suppose I am going to want this eventually. So now let's just wait for this one to finish. Ooh, Naughty Blue has already eaten someone up. When this hits like 21%, I'll allow the building of the next unit. But until then, conserve our money. And we can maybe have a look at who we should do next. That guy looks tasty. He's only got one friend. 
gives me surface area on a whole bunch of other people. And that's hit 21, so we should start building this. Take the unrest. Now, yesterday it took us an hour and 12 minutes to get the whole Japan bit done. We'll probably go a little bit slower because we want to be a bit more stable. Um, rather than the whole, like, loans kind of thing we had going yesterday. We need to be stable beyond the point of forming Japan in this one. But once that's done, there's probably not a lot to do for a long time. Like, I could... Eat up a little bit of Philippines and Indonesia just for some extra cash. This guy's a noob? Yeah, I'm I'm the worst. World's leading EU4 speedrunner. The worst player there's ever been. Boop. Wouldn't mind a claim on you. <laughs> Wait, did you just get your friend eaten? No, he's bigger. Well, that's fine. Thank you, Eggvet. Uh... You need to repair. <clears throat> Very good. Come back. <laughs> and he's got a hundred million friends now, which is real pain. Two, three, four, five, six. This puts us up at six. Ten is the danger point. We need to pay attention to when we hit ten. Because that's when he can declare that we are too big for the realm and start eating us. Six. And then if we do that, seven, eight, nine. So that'll be the last war before we have to go all out. We'll have to say, I'm sorry, Sensei, we have to go all out just this once. We are in the right setting for it after all. <laughs> uh, these are the hardest to reinforce, so hop off, get reinforced, then come back. Beautiful. <sighs> Thank you kindly, it might go crazy. Cheers for the follow, mate. Double check that you have found no new friends. He has found a new friend, sadly. I can still probably overrun that. But I probably don't get away with uh, co-belligerenting the friend anymore. Germany deserves its place in the sun, you reckon, Egbert? Uh, get that claim. I am going to eventually want a claim on... I guess you as well. Although, I should probably just make my friends happier so they put up with all my expanding. Done. Call back. Peace out. Gobble up our enemies. Thank you. Now you. One of these has to stay behind and stop him hiring units. One of you there, one of you there.
No, I'm not putting up with that. Kill. Kill. I said kill. Not run away, kill. Got ya. Okay, and now there, and then there. Seven should beat five. Flanking matters. Our, our religious cast can be powerful. Mm, some of you need to clear out that. Smush. Come on. That's bullshit. And then come back here and here. That really should have been a smush. Uh, what else do I need? I still need my friend to love me more. Oh, my friends are helping. Although they might want some of this land, which could actually backfire. Yeah, I, I wouldn't mind a 244 baby. That That's an average enough baby that I can live with. You go here. See if this guy's willing to let me let him out. Wait, is it you? Who's the one I'm over at war with? That? Oh no, none of them. Okay, good. I thought I was at war with someone over there because that's where they retreated. You guys, come help this. And then we're done. Yo, Ludog! How you doing? Nice to see you. And it's an already of age baby. So what's going on there? You've attacked pink. And pink apparently has no friends. So we should probably get on dogpiling pink. Or dogpiling that guy, who is friends of pink. Full state, full core. Same here. But it was already the right thing. Mm, yeah, I've got the ducats for it. <laughs> We're going to need some more boats. You guys, hop back into port. I'm going to want six and six. We can't afford six yet, though. Soon, TM. Uh, I'm quite happy to lose two war exhaustion. I will help the poor suffering peasants. So there's nothing I can do about this guy except steal all his lunch money. But these two I'll be able to eat up. Because my friend stole that province. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight.
So was it a self-defense wall? No, he attacked you and your friend is just useless is the answer. Okay, let's go attack your friend. Done. Eat up the other guy. And all the cash. Thank you. Did our leader die already? Our leader died already. Ugh. <clears throat> On the upside, we get one with some siege pips. Not you. Everyone else, step off. Come back home. And suppress the rebels for the moment. There's not much else to do. I don't need to be funding this. Suppress. And there. Go do. If I give you your autonomy, you won't rebel. If I give you your autonomy, you won't rebel. If I give you your autonomy, you won't rebel. And eventually the same will be said of this guy. Do I want to spend... 20 ducats on 10 prestige. Not really. No. I'm good, thank you, game. He's getting a bit too big for his britches. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. Oh, no, not 7. That guy in so looks like a good bet. But they'd still have too many too much of a navy for me. You're too too many friends. You've got too many friends. That looks Plausible, except that he's allied to my big enemy. Mm. This guy. Yeah, this guy and this guy are the one to do. So, you over here. Yes, obey my orders. Quit dilly-dallying. Ah, they're hitting us with the unconditional surrender, so we got to gobble this up. Purple seems to have had the same idea. Nine. He might also get too big. Anyway, we were looking at doing this. What do you mean I've got no CB? Oh, I've got no CB, because that's Ashikaga and not me. Hmm, that makes it less attractive. What about you? You've got too many friends. This guy? Yeah, I kind of like doing this and making him lose his war. So let's turn this fort on. Marry our boss. Resuck up to our friend. Declare your stupid friend tasty. Once we're across the river.
Okay. Uh, two more of these. Uh, not in the same province, thank you. In other provinces. And then we should be ready to do pink and so. Uh, blue and so. One bit of ally insurance on that. Who were your other friends and could I eat them? So like now would be a good time to do this one. While well, he can't honour. And then I can break the alliance at the same time. I'm surprised he won't give up for that. My stack committed suicide running into that stack. Well, that's my fault for not paying attention. If I blockaded you, would you change your tune? Not yet. Okay, now he'll change his tune. That and your lunch money. Now we all head over here. My friend ate them up. And now I should be able to do this. Although I should kill my friend first. What happened to that sixth unit? I'm a bit disappointed by that. Uh, I could get a claim on you anyway. Your friend is not helping you, you poor guy. Let's declare that this guy is tasty. That my friend needs to learn to not side against me. You guys take care of that. Oh god, that's a seven. Well, I guess we're coming back for you once we've squished our enemy mostly. What else should we be doing? We should be getting a claim on... You. Prestige, please. Leader, please. Kill. Come back. Kill. Very good. That's less good. 
But it looks like my friends are going to take care of it. Thank you, friends. Same deal, give them their autonomy, and then I'll stop rebelling. Same with the Huger. I need to wait for this to finish, but then we can eat up this guy as well. That gets us our claim on so. I wouldn't mind a claim on our boss. I also wouldn't mind a claim on Shiva. But I should probably actually just spend the time making my allies love me more. So they forgive me for eating everyone. <laughs> Come on, finish. We don't have forever. I don't need to be funding this when my enemies have no units. It helps. You could be doing some looting, if nothing else. I bet that will make that trigger. Yeah, <laughs> I threatened to go do some looting and, oh, the siege is finished. You couldn't possibly go do that looting. Always the way. Get rid of that. Make other friend happy as well. Oh, and they spat someone else out. So I do this one, then we do that one, and these two. Some stab wouldn't hurt either. Go beat up his boats and earn some uh, extra siege rate and some blockading enemy ports money. I'd rather lose the dip. Can some of my friends owe me some cash? Nope. They're not making money. There we go. Give me some money. It helps. Merge. Oh god, yes, I need the money. Thank you. Oh, he found a friend. But it's a friend that's already dying, so we don't really care. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Nine. And then this is ten. So we move here. We get ready to do this guy. I could use war taxes. We could use war taxes. Declare that this guy is taste... D. I mean... I still do this, but only once we've done this. Cool, I only need one unit to be making sure he doesn't hire any units. Other way around. These ones are going to come eat up blue and pink. Especially if you'll help. You've decided... You don't like me anymore. Well, that's not very nice. Why would you do that? We're friends, I say. Anyway, uh, we're meant to be doing pink and blue. So, over to here. 
First step is blue. Co-belligerent there. Sengoku, kill. Smush. You go kill that. Mm, hopefully that wins before they get here. Very good. Corruption fighting needs to ramp up. Kill. Very good. Wait for these to reinforce. Then we eat these two. My boss is not happy. He has broken the alliance. I need the correct number of units over there, but then we can all come back and eat this. I do bother with rooting out corruption. That's all, all monarch points cost. Corruption is all monarch points cost. Do not like. Okay, and then these over here. Actually, we can pick them up straight from there. This will fall in two months because it's got under 100 garrison. If you could let me go past, please. If you could let me go past, please. This guy's about to not exist. Next month it falls because it has zero... Well, it has less than 100. It has less than 100 garrison, so everyone surrenders. Even though we're at minus 7% instead of positive. Done. Eat. Do. Thank you. Come on. And then hop on the boat. Come across to this guy. Mm, I might have to retreat once more. But that would hopefully be the last time. One more month. Uh, I want the manpower option here. Yes, please. And then there is one more. Okay, here then there. Finally they give in. So that lets our five stack land on the island. Five should beat three. As long as it's not something crazy like he's ahead of tactics tech. And he isn't. Woof, 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 says Doggo. Our Doggo's puppy is visiting today. Coming to see his mummy. Cool. And then these hop off as well. And we have some patience. Who's next? Uh, that is next. I do have the ducats for that. I do have the ducats for that. I could stop paying my army because the ones that are doing the um, sieging are mercs and mercs never get low, low reinforcement rate. Well, he's decided he's my rival now. It looks like I should do this guy next. To my eye. I don't know that I really want that fort. Full state, full core. 
Give it its autonomy. Stop us rebelling. Ogasawara. Okay, so that's all his troops. So, two of you stay here. The rest of you come here. Yes, we eat these two up. Uh, I might as well do that one that way. Because then I get to eat your ducats. Now I do that one that way. You come here, please. Preferably the fast way. We are going to need morale if we're going to fight. Give it a couple of months, and I'll eat up purple and here. Oh, he just got annexed by Ashikaga. Okay, what about you? That's awkward. We don't want Ashikaga getting stronger. These two looks like an option, and those two looks like an option. And these two also looks like an option. Full state. Not full core. Not yet. Not when I've got stuff that actually needs needs full coring. Thank you. At least he's not annexing any of the others. Hmm. You know what? Until I eat the others, you are going to be my friend as well. Let our war exhaustion come down for a little bit. Grab the new unit type. Swap over to the new unit type. Double the pips. Woof. <laughs> They're having good fun playing. Um, so who do I do? These three. These two. Or these two. Or these two. Well, I don't do these two because he's allied to me. I like the look of these two, so this needs five. Hopefully my navy is enough to keep the crossing. Come help. Yamana refused to be called in. When does my truce with them end? Is it worth waiting two years to full annex them? Go belligerently. Would they not just call in all my friends anyway? Yeah, I don't think we co belligerent. We can just eat them up. Non co belligerently and say hang the hang the aggressive expansion. Good. One of you go get that. The rest of you come this way. Well, that's kind of super awkward the way that they're... Thank you. Stopping both of those. 
Now I don't mind doing that. Since when do you own that? You go help this, because otherwise we're not going to be able to go save our poor friends. One of you, go stop that. The rest of you, go interrupt this. Hey, he is not just... How do you know, Darkstar? How do you know? Okay, go for it. 8 beats 6. Especially when I have the new unit type. One can just be set to auto-do my allies, because I'm lazy. Why don't I have a diplomatic one? Hello? Where is my dip- Oh, is that part of- That might have actually been part of the DL DLC for Mandate of Heaven, now that I think about it. Boo! Which we've turned off so that, um... I don't have to fight Ming when I want to go take... Ryukyu. That looks like it's about to resolve itself. Go across to here. If my friend wants to eat a bit of it, I don't care. Smush. You ran your first Iron Man last night, and because England stole all the centers of reformation as Prussia, I thought a no CB war after two big wars was a good idea. Also, you were over your gov cap because, of course, Prussia. So, extra A for you. <clears throat> Very good. And come back home. You think you had all of Europe against you? So you could have had more. Wait till you get Europe and then... Oh look, the, the Mamelukes are pissed. Tunisia is pissed. Morocco is pissed. You've eaten so many euros that even they are grumpy. You can have your autonomy. Let's have a look at this. I don't mind giving my friend a bit of food. Actually, I do if it means I can't take bits for myself. Something like that. Who's your next friend? Oda? We could just chain this into Oda. So, you come live here. You come live here. Start this war. You come down there. Then we eat this, but only when we can sit on there, 
And sit on there, and sit on there. Done. I should have ungarrisoned that. At least it will have low garrison. But I should have completely ungarrisoned it and waited until the end of the year. Exclamation mark idiot in chat. I deserve it. Sub optimal play. You take over that so that these can come do these. Maybe go beat up that. <clears throat> and your stuff hasn't even started yet. Turn off this leader here. I want them over here. What do you mean you need a transport? Fine, if you need a transport, use a transport. It's ridiculous. Money over time, rather than direct money. How about you just teleport yourself to there via boat? Go catch them. Go stop them moving. I was supposed to... Assign the leader first. Okay. Didn't end up mattering. Good. Yeah, I mean, it's all very... It's all very uh, foreign to me, Galgamus. We don't have tornadoes here. So it's it's very much a foreign concept to us. Aside from seeing like storm chasers and things like that on TV, like we get we get some idea about it, but it's not something that's a lived experience here. We never have to have, where I am, storm, you know, go hide in a storm shelter or go cower in your basement and tape up all your windows and do all that stuff. How does three not beat half? How does three not beat half? Oh, come on. That's getting kind of annoying, honestly. Smush. Thank you. It's kind of tempting to get this, use that to beat up this. Because this one is kind of spent, and then we can replace it. This, and this, and then that. So I kind of want these to run in head first, because these are the ones that I want to get rid of. Yep. Perfect. Gets rid of our over the force limit problem. <clears throat> I 
And then down there. Now, will I be able to just full annex? How big is this guy, I guess, is the question. He's 66, and you are... 6, 7, 8, 9. So, yep, we should be able to full annex our enemies here. Bring our boats. I'm honestly tempted to just go bang bang. And yet we can't. So... This guy is the next one. Because he's not allied to anyone that I'm allied to. Kind of. He's only allied to one of the guys that I'm allied to. Oh, cheers, Prime Tech TV. Prime Keck TV, thank you for the raid, thank you for the host. What were you playing, mate? You over here, playing some EU4. So this finishes, come over here, fix this, and then work out if we can do blue and my friend. The Orthomans. Orthodox Ottomans. So you do that for two reasons. One... Because if you turn Catholic, you can potentially become a uh, HRE boss. Although it's really hard to get the uh, religious leagues to agree to the, the flat piece of any religion is okay these days. It's really, really hard to get that. And the other reason is it means that you can holy war all the Sunni world super easy. And of course playing the Game of Thrones, but psh, that goes without saying. One more unit. You got him to Peace of Westphalia by pulling Muscovy out of the League War in a PU while his side was winning. Can you make a reason to do a Jewish author blob? I mean, the same reason. You get Holy War on everyone. It's the same reason you do any of the teeny tiny religions so that you get Amazing Holy War. Okay, we absorb all of these. Sucks to be people that aren't me. Very good. You're all supposed to get over here, thank you. I don't really want to pay the ducats. And it doesn't look like my units are going to be over here quickly enough. So it looks like we take another loan. Sucks to be me. New leader. Smack. Okay. I was going to say to get rid of you, but we can use you to go fight those rebels. Now, who's next? My two friends do still love me. Although, actually, this guy's given up my friendship. Which is all the more reason to attack Uitsugi. The game really doesn't want me to have stab. Go even slightly more over the force limit. Having our boss love us anymore doesn't do anything. Yes, I do want to become independent. <sighs> oh, 
Okay, and then we get rid of this one. Consolidate down. Stop paying over the force limit. Or at least as much. And then it's time to do you and him. Start that last core and declare you tasty, which is to say your friend, right? That friend, this friend. Okay, so I want to be sitting there. Hello, another loan. It's tempting to do that. He's trying to hide his units down the other end of the world. I can't really afford to fight my friend as well, so we just do it like this. Leave one. Otherwise, come kill. It's really cheesy that they move their units to the other end of the country that you're in. But whatever. And then head down there. Kill them. Thank you. Now here. And then one of you go to there, and one of you go to there. Bullshit. Please end the fight before the end of the month. I have to cancel my movement so that we get this back in two months. <clears throat> This, then that. And then here to here, and then these go hunt down the last of our enemies. Okay, they both go hunt down the last of our enemies anyway. Did we get ya? Ah. Fine, let's work the other way. Got ya. And then that's GG for our dear friend. And if you try to escape, we say no. Oh, come on. Got ya. Six beats five, ten beats five. Especially with the new tactics tech. Fix these two. Then go fix this guy.
One more temporarily. Beat this up and then get rid of them. He's already running away. His cowardice knows no bounds. Got ya. Five should beat four. Especially with reinforcements. Consolidate away. Problem solved. Okay. Go help out the siege. That's just gonna have to stay that way for a little while. Uh, I need you to like me still, so thank you. You go help the siege. You go help the other siege. Okay, or new plan. All of you come deal with these rebels. That can wait. It's not going anywhere. And I don't really need this fort anymore. That one can stay. Merc stack. You can lead the way, please. You are the most sacrificial. Very good. Merc stack, head over to here. In fact, if you could head over by boat, that would be far quicker. Beautiful. You guys head over here. Okay. <sighs> He's not annexing any of the others. Let's have a look at this. I want to eat it all up. It requires more than 100 war score, so I have to eat you separately, even if it costs dip. Sucks to be you. Also sucks to be me paying dip, but sucks to be him more. I still exist. And then it's time to do this guy. So we probably take the next tactics tech and then smush his brains all over the ground. Those of you who are injured should repair. Uh, wouldn't hurt to have a claim on Kyoto. Certainly wouldn't hurt. That's a big province to be coring. Lose the dip. New horsey type. Mm, I can't give them any more autonomy. There's no more autonomy to give. I can get rid of that. I could also have you sit on them. Or not. Come sit here. It's time to kill our boss. I think. Call back. Absorb. Num num. Oh, no truce, you say. To shreds, you say. This ally of mine's really finding it hard to justify staying friends with me.
And his wife? To shreds, you say. Yes. Good news, everyone. Got ya. Kill. Both should be helping the siege. Smush. And it's time to get ready for doing our boss. Wait, wait, are they just the same color? Yeah, yeah, yeah. This guy is a slightly darker green than me. You zoom in, he's slightly darker green. Got our claim on our boss. So as soon as this siege is done, I'm happy to go more over the force limit for the sake of beating up our boss temporarily. That's annoying. Well, we used the same color CB, Darkstar. They're being removed. Don't you worry. Done. Everyone who isn't the Mercs, merge together. Okay, you, welcome to population being dead. Okay, and then here. And we're done. Don't need to be over the force limit anymore. But we aren't really. So instead we could get ready for fighting the rebels. can fight that. Bring it. Start with that. Then that one. Make sure our friends love us. here. And then there. And then there. Looks like we're going to have to declare another Freedom War because I didn't actually get the Kyoto Siege myself. Exclamation mark idiot. We waste one stab up. On the other hand, it lets me do this. No, it doesn't, because my friend can't eat it. Does my friend want the other bit? Maybe. Well, we'll see if we can give him both bits. He doesn't want it. You jerk! No, I don't care. Done.
Give me the occupations or die. Well, another thing that I could do is uh, hand it all over to our friend and see what he does with that. I don't even know what would happen then. That's interesting. I want to learn. He should peace out. He has 100%. Hello? I have not seen the AI not do that before. Like, sometimes it takes them a couple of months to realise their diplomats should be piecing out, but... Not normally this long. So I need to do this, and then attack my friend. Which we can't do because of this. It's actually kind of tempting to just click this. Fix that problem. Then I can stab up. Without spending an arm and a leg. Kill my friend. No, I'm not allowed to. Leave the war. I don't want that. I don't just want independence. I want to eat him. Ugh. Well, we eat our friends now. After we milk them for anything that we can, but they don't like me enough. So we just get ready to milk them. Oh, to, to kill them, sorry. What a ridiculous... Ugh. Grumble, grumble, grumble. If they can't take it, they should give it away. Grumble, grumble, grumble. Slash, they should give you the option of not calling in your allies. It auto-called in my allies. Like, I didn't want to call them in. I would have preferred to eat them as well in that war. In fact... I'm kind of tempted to just go no see, like, truce break here. It only costs us one stab, realistically. Done. Eh, it costs us a bit of war exhaustion. That's true. But we we're going to have to fight all these rebels anyway. Because we were going to start entering lower autonomy mode. claims on my ex-friend and I need claims on my other ex-friend good I suppose the answer is I should have de-allied them before I clicked the declare war on boss button 
is the way I could have controlled calling them in. One more. Kill that. So we're already a bit slower than yesterday because we would have had this by now yesterday and we would have had this by now. Windows has detected no viruses. Yeah, good news, Windows. Well done. Kill that and then that. You get to be eaten. Numb. Kill that while we're here. Start paying this shit off. So this is a bit of a chicken and egg problem. What we'll do is borrow money from our these guys hello where is it there we go we borrow money from these guys to buy the mercs to kill off all the rebels Pretty sure I said you do it. But okay. Uh, go back to claiming this guy. Claim one. I'm going to need one on this guy. Oh, I don't need any of these. No, I do need these claims. I was going to say I don't need any of these claims, but we do. Very good. Don't care. You move over. Where's the next one that's going to occur? That one. You go here. This guy is dead. Slightly too slow. Who's next? That guy down here. What we should do is lower all our autonomies. Now is the time to rule with an iron fist. Poke the bear. Who's next? Poke this bear. One more. Claim two. One of my truces with my friends. And basically, straight away.
recover our manpower is fine. Poke this. Next is Ashikaga. Next. Ouchie. Can the Ouchie Rebels cause us an Ouchie? And then it will be time to eat this. here. It's time to kill you. Get our claim. Typical. three stabs, so we do have to wait a little bit. Fine, we'll deal with more rebels. You. This one, then that one, then that one. How do you break out of this death cycle? Uh, well, our lowering autonomy will fix this as soon as we aren't over force limit. As soon as we're not over force limit, we'll be fine. We're only over force limit for the sake of fighting all these rebels. So it's it's not really a debt spiral at all. It's a debt spike. And then we'll spring back. Provoke. Done. Then down here. Provoke done. And then these ones. I mean, I don't, I just, I could not fight all these rebels without the Merc stack. Absolutely could not do it. I'd run out of men. And then Ugo. Actually do that one on the way. Takeda. <sighs> then Ugo. Okay, and then this guy. Nearly done. See if there's a stab cost guy. There is. Start working our way back to actual stability. Might as well do this one while we're here. I remember when mercs were just expensive in, in, in infantry. Yup. And you could have as many of them as you could afford. There was no limit. And then that one. I 
I'm actually going to need to focus this. Okay, now you. And then Hojo. Okay, and then Uitsugi. Come on, I need these last two to happen. And I can transition out of the Mercs. Uh, yeah, they do get a lot of it, because the way that it works is, these days, you get a general for every 40 or 50, whatever it is, um, force limit. And therefore, the Ottomans and Austria, who get free, well, not quite free force limit in the case of the Ottomans, but the Ottomans are big, so they have lots of force limit, and Austria get free force limit from being the Emperor, that means they get free generals. Um, well, they get free general slots. The AI does not pay to roll generals. They get to roll generals for free. So they get to turn those free general slots into free professionalism. Which is a little bit unfair. I don't get free generals. Why should they? The AI should play by the same rules as the player. Now, if you try to start crossing this island, you get to die. Uh, it's not a case... They won't throw away bad ones. They won't just infinitely re-roll. But they do get to roll up to their limit, and they will roll up to their limit for free. And yeah, if you've got like a 600 force limit Ottomans, that means on average he's rolling one and a half generals every year. So he gets a free and a half. He gets 2% professionalism every year. So every two years he gets a slacken, more or less. For free. This one, that one, that one, that one, and then we're done. Very good. You head here, he fix that. And then this one. That one. And then there were no more rebels. Goodbye, giant merc stack. Hello, making money again. Debt spiral ended.
End of the year, we'll click that, click this, and start paying these off. Now, what does it take for us to form Japan the other way? Normally it highlights that. Okay, so you have to eat up all the other daimyos, which we'll, we will work on. Get our navy in place. Declare that he is tasty. Once we can stab up. And then I'm going to want claims on you. Do I already have my claim on this guy? No, so let's work on our claim on you. Call back. We're ready to Dow. I don't care about devastation. I do care about you not being inside of our nation. little bit worried about Korea. Okay, pay off the bad ones. Yuck. Yuck. Ooh, yes please. 200 ducats is nice. Our forces are obsolete. That's another one of the bad ones gone. Another two of the bad ones gone. Okay, and then here. Looting. Get ready to gobble this up. Get our claim. These come down here, get ready to eat him. It gets rid of all 100% of the separatism we have. Beautiful. Uh, no, it's definitely time to dev push. I should dev push something that's next to, but not actually my capital. 
That looks fine. go. Declare that this guy is tasty. Go for it. Then we come up and do this guy. Uh, no Dark Star. We've turned off Mandate of Heaven, so there are no edicts. We've turned off Mandate of Heaven so that I can eat this guy without Japan, without Ming getting involved. Neither will Ming protect Korea, neither will Ming protect these guys, etc, etc. Which was part of how we got yesterday's speedrun done a good half an hour quicker. So, did not edict because there is no edict. No such thing. What's an edict? Only leave four. And then the rest come back up here. Get ready to do... Hainu. So we've met part one of the uh, speedrun requirements. Be Japan. We're about to meet part two. Own all of the Japanese region. back here. Peace out. Absorb. Do. Numb. Now if there's an itty bitty baby one I wouldn't mind it. Okay, I want this. Give. Make sure he can't get off his island. Rat is preparing to attack his back. Actually, we should just stay here until we're ready to push over to there. And ta-da, stage two. We have converted, well, we've absorbed every bit of Japan at the end of this war. Then stage three is become Christian and stage four is convert everything to Christian. You know what? I'm gonna do something I very rarely do. Click that button, buy us some more time. Get 
jump. What an unfortunate time to die. Cool. And come back home. Do not want that board. It's going to be a while. All our loans are the not so bad ones. Thirty one is quite a number, though. How would you feel about becoming my friend? No! What about you? Demand your pension, you're not getting it. No free rides. Okay, and then one more. Two more, and we're finished. to go guard this and go guard Ainu. If they're going to rebel anyway, we might as well lower autonomy. Go guard up here. Mm. And it's honestly mostly just chill. We need to wait for a Catholic to come find us and then <laughs> absorb their religion. What we could maybe do to speed the process up is move our capital into Australia and then absorb some of the uh, CNs because that would let us eat a whole bunch of Catholic provinces fairly reasonably. I'd probably want to start doing this. Mm. 
minimize my Shinto dev so that eventually we can have more Catholic dev than it. It also means the cost for embracing the institution goes down, which is always lovely. Yep. We just became a great power. Yep. We are equally as good as Denmark. Boost. No more peasants war. Okay, then we got a full state everything. Although, actually, if I'm thinking about moving my capital into... <sighs> into Australia, I should stop full stating everything. Yeah, so no more of that. What have we done? Gain a stab. We'll wait until we hit stab two for that. Discipline, don't need it yet. Prestige and legitimacy, don't really need it yet. Gain claims on Korea. Don't specifically want it. Have more navy. Don't really want it. Then they're all obsessed with... Um, they're all obsessed... With conquering Korea. Recover our manpower is fine. We're going to do that anyway, because we're not going to have anything to do other than sit and train. There's no need to poke these, because they're going to occur sooner or later. Yeah, that's going to occur quickly enough regardless of whether we poke them. That's just going to taunt me, but it's not the right thing. The right thing is to admin tech, admin tech, get exploration, come down to Australia, move our capital here, jump across to here, get something here, jump across to the new world and absorb all the Catholic dev we need. Maybe it would also potentially be worth doing the same thing via Coptic instead, but I feel like the CN route will be easier. Alright, then come home and train. Try and keep Ming sweet on us. Minimize our navy costs. You can train. So I wanted one more, and then I wanted to click the mission one. But they're no longer loyal enough because I just yoinked their land. So give them a half dozen months and they'll become happy again. We 
We're actually spectacularly old. Our heir died. It would seem. You're losing great power status. Because the Mamluks have shot up. One more. And there's nothing more for these to do. Except let time pass. And it's chill. Chill. tax money. Inflation go away. Autonomy go away. It's not like I need other cultures. We get auto union. Well, we get auto acceptance on our, our other Japanese cultures. That keeps trying to tempt me, but no. We save up to pay those off. Woo! Ra rewards my cruelty with a 555 baby. Although we're going to lose our namesake, original namesake dynasty, but who cares? You want me to throw away a 555 baby, Lou Dog? You're crazy. That baby stays. Sometimes sacrifices must be made. Well, now is not one of those times. We do not sacrifice the 555 baby. How long do we have for this mission to finish? Oh, heaps of time. You wish him a long and healthy life. Hey, oh, crack Jesus. How's the run going? We were a bit slower on uniting Japan than yesterday, but we also are a much more stable and debt-free Japan, which is kind of going to be very helpful for the next phases. You're having an epic struggle right now as Provence. Have you kept France on your side, or has France gone evil? I bet France has gone evil, because that's what France do. Oh, you've taken Maine. I want Maine. Yeah. One more year and we can get rid of this. When is France not evil? They're especially evil if you take Maine, because they're your ally. They're your ally in this hundred year war. And then they go, no, nah, not friends, not anymore, no. <laughs> they claimed your throne when the entire HRE in England was in a coalition. So you took their south coast. 
No Ducal Ring of Normandy for them. You know what? Turn that off. I don't want to get... That's just going to annoy me at the moment. And I don't do that because we're going to go exploration first. They've hit 80, so we stop. So that we're ready to fight them. Quit cowering. Fight them. It's, it's like three nobles. You didn't know you get AE for getting the Burgundian Succession PU. For a while there, they had it that even clicking the Claim Throne button gave you AE. Yes, Kirishitan Japan today. Bit of an interesting start, and then a chill, chill while while we colonize. We're going to try and move our capital down here, and then go eat up some CNs to get another Catholic. That is my theory. If you have a better a better plan, I'm I'm all ears. I'm willing to hear other options. That seems like the most reasonable way of getting a uh, Catholic as quickly as possible. Yes, and then exploration. Yes. Pay off the first of our burger loans. Yeah, I did think about Coptic, but honestly, Ethiopia is harder to beat up than the CNs. The CNs let me get more land more easily. We thought and talked about doing Coptic. There's also the tiny problem of it kind of looks like Ethiopia doesn't exist. From what we can see, Adal and whatnot have all eaten him. Not that we can actually see, but we can see the coast. And we can guess that's still Adal, because it's pink. Hey, Dill Pickle. Fix that, fix that, then come back home and train. Uh, it's not a case of getting the rebels to teleport, it's a case of I expect to have majority religion Catholic. Even if it means releasing some of these nations and forcing religion and converting them. How's it doing? We're doing okay today. I think I'm a little bit addicted to Battle Brothers though. Just a little bit. Totally didn't stay up till like 4 in the morning playing Battle Brothers. Off screen. Wouldn't do that. That would be irresponsible. Uh, we're going to need three of these to go exploring. 
Six wouldn't hurt either. I'm willing to put up with that slowdown. If there was a cheap land maintenance man, I'd also live with him. There is cheap conversion man. Um, I don't know if we still get the incidents. Yeah, no incidents. Aren't they part of the mandate of heaven? They might also be part of being the um other government type, which we stopped being because of our ally being stupid. We don't need to be Shogun. And we had to abandon being a Daimyo in order to stab up cost effectively when we rebelled against our king. When we rebelled against the um the Shogun. Yes, we've turned off Mandate of Heaven, of course, else I wouldn't be able to eat this without having to fight Ming. I don't want to have to spend the same problem as yesterday. Um, fighting Ming. We learnt, we learnt that turning off Mandate of Heaven is the right thing to do for this achievement, so you don't have to fight Ming for that. You might say, shouldn't you focus dip now? And I would say no, because we're going to want to get religious ideas done as well. To convert everything as quickly as possible. Actually, I should leave them like this, because the pig is easier to convert than Shinto. Wiki says you can still go Catholic through events. So you think if we meet Portugal slash the other Europeans, we'll get the um, we'll get the event mm, around sixteen hundred. I might well be able to eat enough CN before then that we beat that. So that's the new race. Can I beat the Christian event? I should stand down. Get our 555 baby on the throne. Uh, papal influence doesn't help you convert. Defender of the Faith does, because it gives you more, more missionary. More missionary is helpful. So I can definitely be the defender of the Catholic faith in uh, Asia. One more month. And it's also time to stop training again. Because the noble rebels want to rise up. That'll do. And then that. Okay. <clears throat> Maybe it pops up later. It might be to do with what government you are, Galgamus. Uh, it might need you to be Shogunate. We choose to slaughter the natives. From 
here, we eat you and this guy. Doesn't have to do with government type. Okay. Rebels destroyed. Barely a scratch. I am willing to do that and then sell, and that will get rid of our, um... That will get rid of the last of these. I like the look of that. Enforce our heritage. No, thank you. Get over there. Okay, orange claim one. Blue claim one. So we know how this bit works because we've done it before as um, Korea. We did it when we were Korea trying to eat up all the Eastern um, Eastern religion people. Now do the coast. His friend won't help. We can steal this siege from the pig people. As if they have a 10 stack here. Ugh, whatever. Take the cash. Hey, cheers, Kaladin. Thank you for the raid. Thank you for the host. <laughs> for those of you just joining, I love it when I beat the sound. Um, we are trying to do Kirishitan Japan as a speedrun. We have United Japan. We started as Hokusawa. Um, we're currently trying to work our way down to Australia. I want to move my capital into Australia so that we can then go eat up the CNs and hopefully get enough Catholic dev to swap religion. Yeah, the, the conditions are one is Japan, check. Two is in religious group Christian, not yet. And three, all provinces in the Japanese region are Christian religion, but it doesn't say they have to be yours. So I can release subjects over there. Extend the rest of the two burger loans. Um, release subjects over there to then convert them. You haven't felt lucky like this since you got a Russia PU. Uh, you should be helping that siege. 
You go get this claim. We need a little more patience before we declare this war. Num 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 num. Pop down. No, you don't want to pop down? Fine. Oh, you say there's nowhere to explore. Then help protect trade. Let's assume that I do eat that, eat that guy. I'm going to want to eat this guy as well. Your job is done. This is about to succeed. Get ready for that peace out. Numb. Money. Done. Wait for the siege to finish and click. Provence has amazing missions. They start with the French dynasty and they can join the HRE before they get big. So, when France does turn on you, you can usually get Austria slash England slash Castile as a friend as long as they hate France because France is threatening you. Later, you use your dynasty matching France's to PU them. Boom, get rid of that. Very good, and then this will hopefully reach down here. And of course they get all their mission PU malarkey. Oh, a free PU on Naples, and a free PU on Aragon, and a free PU on Hungary. together. I really wish that you could like click a button here and it would flip to their navies. They, they could totally put a little button here that's like army slash navy and you could click it and see the other kind of military force that the, uh, your enemies have. Ah uh, no it's well, actually, Confucian is good for us, so yes. The cores are kind of nicer. Personal strength. Personal strength. And less, less AE. Because it's Reconquest. Okay, so to do that one. What do I do that one? I think I do that one. Because then he'll let me eat up Manila. Why the heck are you doing that? You can walk there, bro. Oh, you guys need to go hide. Always hide during war. Thank you. And if that core is done, I'll probably be able to reach to there. Or at the very least, I'll be able to reach there to here, and that will let me take that one as well. Production. And then once you've cleared that, I want you to come back here and then down to there.
Okay, you hop out there. These hop over to here. I don't need that yet. I don't need that yet. The rest of the mission tree is basically just saying, Go conquer Korea! And I'm not interested in that. That doesn't help our goal. In fact, it anti-helps our goal. gonna have a army soon and they'll they'll give in done I have to rebuild some of that so what did we lose we lost two of these and a handful of these that will do nicely yes and then we want religious next Cannot make it a core? Really? Ah, this hasn't finished yet. Soon TM. There we go, now I bet I can make it a core. Perfect. So that lets us jump from here to here, and then from there down to Australia. Oof. Woof, says Doggo outside. I don't know what reset my trader, but whatever, we fix it. Yes, I have to go fix that again. So if this could finish, that would be helpful. That we can deal with. too long or else they're going to become even more pain. 14, 14, 14, 14, 14. Oh, for a CK3 style siege system where you always make progress. Even if the progress is slower. Like even if it just ticked up by 4% a month instead of 7. As long as it was always making progress. Hell, even 2. Just... Just make it always make progress so it doesn't feel bad. I do want that. There we go. You welcome inside our nation.
numb, and numb, get rid of the fort, and then from here we just eat everything. Actually, there's maybe an argument to be made for not eating everything. Because then I won't have as much wrong culture and religion land. I need this one, because this one's what lets us jump down to Japan. But the rest I could re-release. that for him. It's not all bad. <sighs> what should always progress? Siege. Sieges should always progress. So the way the siege system here works is if you get a good roll, it ticks up and it goes from like 7 to 14, 14 to 21, 21 to 28, etc. In the CK, the way the system works is no matter what, it always goes up. And if you get a good tick, it goes up extra. And even if the amount that you go up per month is slower or less, it feels better because you never don't make progress. That one, and then one more. Done, and then I don't need to own this other province. Beautiful. Make our new minion love us. Uh, one of these needs to come back here, please. We should be able to set you to exploring. I said exploring. Kill that. Come on, kill it. Good. Okay. You you save up some bank. Is what you do. And you enjoy not needing to worry about money. Okay, these all come down here, please. Go explore wherever. We won't be able to see Australia until this core finishes. Fight them. These should be earning me money. You've managed to get rid of their maxed land. Good to hear. None of this. 
I might as well be carrying favors with him in case I have to release the other people in Japan and make them so big that they become disloyal. One. <sighs> don't we have missions for Taiwan? I don't know, but it's, it's stuck behind stuff we don't want. Conquer Korea, conquer Korea, conquer Korea, conquer Korea, unite Japan, get Okinawa, then there's Taiwan. But I'm not, I'm not going to go do Korea. Also, I don't want to make myself have more non-Christian land. So, like, absorbing this would be bad. Okay, we can see Australia. This is the one that we need. And then you can go from here into there. What's Battle Bros? Uh, it's a economy management slash turn-based tactics game. Perfect timing. Slaughter the natives. I don't think that it's the AI fears big stacks more, they're just willing to reinforce less. Unless the fight is on favourable terrain, they will not reinforce as much. Was that our 555 baby coming to power? It was. I'll take the colonial range. And this. Can we do another bit of this? Okay. Glorious baby lived. Despite you trying to tempt me to throw him down the well, Lou Dog. So don't you even try and claim an ounce of responsibility for him living. Uh, yes and no, Dill Pickle. The, their fort building is really a thermometer for how good their economy is. Like, I've smacked the Ottomans once, and they went from having, like, five forts on the, um... Balkan side and eight on the Anatolian side to just deleting every single fort they had in one war. You're just trying to flesh out the law around Ra rewards our cruelty. 
it's from an Afero to remember. So I'm going to want that, and then I'm going to want one down here. And that's the center of trade, so why not? No, that's trying to trick me into converting it into a harder to convert religion. Uh, I should look if I can pass the ones that let the colonies move quicker. So like that one. No, these all suck. I'd rather do the manpower dev. Especially as we need to dev up colonialism anyway. It's not too much further. And it's time for a second explorer. See if we can get away with just one more mill click. What the heck? Ah, well, I don't need that anymore, so... There. Ah, uh, mill. Thank you, that lets us do this with mill clicks. Perfect. Now we just need to wait for a little money. Southwest Pacific Coast, Southwest Pacific Coast. <sighs> um, this will be both, because there's currently no record. There is currently no record, so we will win both categories. Del Peckle. But yes, there are both kinds of speedruns. And sometimes they need very different strategies. When there's no record, you can, you know, you can suck at both. <laughs> and still win the gold medal. Uh, but there are some that are pretty highly optimised. One way and the other. And the way about going and getting it for in-game time can be very, very different to getting the uh, real-time attack. Slaughter these. Thank you. Go explore the first one. Go explore the second one. Might as well head over there. You go explore that one. What is the time date estimate? Uh, I think that it's 4.25 Tuesday the 22nd of March 2022. <laughs> uh, 
No, um, I mean, the worst case is we wait for 1600 and then probably 20 years to convert all this crap. 20 or 30 years. So worst case, I'm expecting 1630. And that means probably... Probably another four hours, maybe? <laughs> um, release all the little daimyos and convert them. Yeah, quite possibly. Sounds like a reasonable approach. Should be able to go do the north, northwest coast. Find out about over here. Oh, a guy exploring the Indian Ocean died, which is why we built a second one. Now, would we be faster going Kilwa, Brazil, or going here, and then down to California? It's probably approximately even. Has this paradox fixed how CNs get calls on stuff as long as you started them when they spawn? I don't think so. I don't think so. We've been using that trick. I don't know if we've used it on this patch yet. But we were certainly using it as recently as last patch. I have so little of the Japan trade. I guess we embargo you back. Doesn't hurt. Might as well eat these up into our guy. Done. Oh my god, they're obsessed with ramming their boats into my boats.
Ugh. Good. Yes, you do. You lose the CB if you break the marriage. So you got to pay the stab cost. That is the cost of getting a whole nation for free. Instead of needing to eat them over five wars. Our wife can bang whoever she likes. Hey, Pisces freak. How you doing, mate? Merge those together. Get the excess units off the province. Actually, nope. You need to run away. There's too many of them. Grumble, grumble. Soon that will finish and the problem will go away. We can use both stacks. The other thing we could do is consider bringing more troops over, but eh. Oh, Korea is apparently not embargoing me anymore. Yes, please. Still need a bit more money. Good dude? Yeah, I'm, I'm doing well. I had a very weird dream. It was... set in a house not entirely unlike the Shining House. Where the house is, like, trying to kill you. Except that it was more of a, like, a maze. Rather than it just being weird. Like, lots and lots of rooms that were clearly traps. a cost. Then crush this and then go do Sulu. I knew again, that's fine.
You go get Sulu out. Uh, no, they must have undone it, because otherwise it would say... It wouldn't give you that banner. It doesn't cost you to do it against people that are doing it against you from memory, doesn't it? And then he dies, and then he lets us let him out. And then you come back here. And then we gobble all this up in the name of our guy. Tell me when will it be mine? Tell me, Tondo, Tondo, Tondo. Done. Okay, send 10 to go deal with the Ainu. And then here. Oh no, they are embargoing us. Well, fine, we'll set them as our enemy again. Ugh, Ming has chosen us, that's terrible. Korea. Ayatthaya, I'm not choosing Ming, I refuse Ming. Utterly and totally. Very good. I'm going to need to save some admin to move my capital. We should start trusting this guy down. One. I'm extremely happy I don't share a C-Zone with this guy. Two. Three, and then one more. Manpower man is sensible. Stability cost man is fine. No, Ming will not blow up. Ming is a strong independent Ming who doesn't need no Shun or Wu or... Uh, what's the other one that gets spat out down here? Min? Yue. Yue. Yue is the other one. Oops, I was meant to be saving up to move our capital. Ah, uh, whatever. So this finishes, then we finish this one, and then we start working out how we're jumping over to the, um... Everyone who doesn't have their capital in a... In the new world can create colonial nations. Nagoki. So it doesn't matter if your capital is in Afro Eurasia, you can move your capital, you can have a colonial nation. If your capital is in uh, Oceania, no. And if your capital is in North and South America, the Americas, then no. But Afro Eurasia, if your capital's there, then yes, you will get CNs. Yes, please. It's not a it's not a very special plan, Dill Pickle. Uh, at the moment, the way we're planning on getting Catholic is to move our capital here, jump our way down to Mexico slash Cuba slash um, Colombia, and see if we can't eat enough Catholic dev from the CNs. Fingers crossed. 
Or we might come this way. Actually, coming this way is probably better because they're more likely to convert the Brazil ones than the Mexican ones. New Zealand could have been a colonial nation if they tried. Uh, why can't I explore? Because you think you have orders. Try again. Done. <laughs> Become less than a hundred percent. I'd need to be. Uh, I'd need to be pig. So if we gave up all this land. Became Okinawan pig once we got Okinawan, collapsed so that we became pig, then we could um, get or use Imerti as a way of becoming Catholic, yes. Yeah, but you, the only way we could give in from Shinto is by doing the OPM stuff, Galgamus. So. Mm. I suppose you could argue we could become majority Tengri. And then go from Tengri to Tengri to Pig or Tengri to Catholic. That would also work. We'll state it because we do want to make it our capital. And now it's going to say, you can't move your capital into a colonial region. And then we move our capital here. And then it will let us, hopefully. Thank you, Zuzu, for the follow. Uh, yes, please do that. We're even going to go find out about New Zealand. And realistically, New Zealand is much further north on this map than it really should be. Like, once we see New Zealand, I'll complain more vigorously about it. Trust. So, like, this bit of New Zealand, the top of New Zealand, should actually be more in line with, like, here not up here. Definitely this bit should be below Tazzy. New units. Yes, New, New Caledonia is extra close to here as a result. Northwest Pacific. Southwest Pacific Coast. Someone in chat is saying that the capital city, which is sort of up here, is supposed to be in line with this. Didn't they inherit this map from 1399? 
Uh, if the map looked like it did in 1330, I, th I think you'd be s disgusted at how inaccurate the map is in 1399. Even, like, amalgamating all the best world maps. Okay, you go explore Northwest Pacific Coast. You go explore Western Indian Ocean. New cannons? No, new infantry. The Aquabusters. Gold is now produced in Ichigo. Ka-ching! Go explore Northeast Pacific. Killua, if I sucked up to you, would you let me buy some land from you? No, that's trying to trick me. <sighs> Bye, Bangkok. No, it would have to be on a different continent, Galgamus. I can't buy bits in Asia. I'm allowed to buy bits in Africa. Not too much longer and this will finish. Oh, can we see Hawaii? Yes, we will be able to see Hawaii at the end of this. Go explore the first thing with the word coast. can see if we can even reach here. Absolutely not. I'd have to come here first, and then maybe I could get Killer. Oh, this one's finished. So, do we go do like here? Can I actually reach? Can I go get the Dodos? No, the dodos are too far away. And we already have the range extending one. And we already have this range extending one. So there's no real further improvements to be had there. Full state, full core. Move our capital. Only when our capital is the only province in a state on that continent. So I have to destate everything else. This is going to hurt. Okay, what about now? 
Oh, I have to do that one as well. What about now? Our capital is the only province in a state on that continent. Hello, game. Are you drunk? Look. Only state. I should be able to go here. What am I missing? And how much do we need to lower our army size? Quite a bit. Get rid of that. Get rid of that. Get rid of that. <laughs> no, it's not that the AI is in my state. That doesn't matter. It might be that I don't have two provinces next to each other, which we might be able to cheese by sending this here and convincing it that I have two. No, look. Nowhere else has a state. Uh... Not a state. The only one that is a state is that one. Oh, this claims it's a state. No, but it is a state. That makes sense. I, you have to be able to have at least one. What about now? That should be working. Hmm. What am I forgetting? That doesn't help us do what we want to do, do true Turkmen. We want to move our capital here for very specific reasons. What am I forgetting? Well, for one, I'm forgetting how to have money. So let's temporarily restate this one. Well, I don't want to. It's the simple answer there. It did make embracing the institution cheaper. What am I forgetting? We want our capital here so that I can eat up the colonial nations without um, Mama Bear getting involved. Ah, our fleet is too big. Well, that's an easy one to fix. You... Go away. What about now? Still too big. You... Go away. You... Go away. How much does that help? Well, it's at least made it not a hundred million dollars. Don't care. Do it eventually. What am I forgetting? Hmm. Blah 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 
The capital can only be moved from a non-colonial region into a colonial region if the current capital is the last stated province on that continent, while also isolated from all other territorial cores on that continent. I think that's true. This is the last stated core on this continent. Am I missing something? Missing. No, rebels aren't aren't the solution there. Can only move from a non-colonial region to a colonial region if the current capital is the last stated province on that continent. It is. While also isolated from all other territorial cores on that continent. It is. It doesn't share a a sea zone with any other territorial cores on that continent. It doesn't share a land border with any other territorial cores on that continent. <clears throat> this would typically require unstating all of one's provinces on that continent and giving all those around the capital away to a vassal until just that one is left, one's isolated capital. Well, we could try it by moving it here. It might be that these are counting as somehow making it not isolated. Nope, there are definitely no um, full cores anywhere else. Like, we can see that here. And we can see that in here. Not a full state. That one's the one that's got our capital, and everything else is one that we could click on to turn it into a state. So it's definitely not that. No, but you usually use this one to do it, and we've done it before. We did it not that long ago in one of the other... Um, what one did we do it in? We did it in... We did it in one of the other recent runs, where we used it to move here and then... Eat, um... Eat... Eat the CNs. Basically like what we're doing now. Eh, let's move it here. Get rid of that. There we go. Okay, so now we're a new worlder. We can restate everything. So the trick is use this one now. Fair enough. And then this... Can all have force limit and money again? Yes, please. Please recover our economy. To the... To a reasonable extent. New cav. New cannon. We do need to recall stuff. And we should start with the gold mine.
thank you. And this other gold mine. Thank you. Economy is recovered. <laughs> Core two gold mines. Your economy is all right. Ay, ay, ay. So I don't need this anymore, although we're already there. Let's go clear that up. It's probably reasonable to get rid of you now. Well, no, I shouldn't. Because this will still help me turn, turn Catholic easier. Okay, and then we want, what, EU4, Japan events. I want to find out the exact triggers for the Catholic event, because honestly it might be easier for me to just restate them and speed up their converting that way. Kirishi turn. Trigger conditions. Mandate of Heaven is not active. Tick. Culture is Japanese. Tick. Religion is not Jap is not Catholic. Tick. Any own province. Culture is Japanese. Tick. Religion is Catholic. Not tick. So it's not that one. Is it Nanban Boeki? Japan has encountered the West. 200 months to happen. No, that one doesn't set anything to Catholic, although it does set us as having encountered the West. You go explore wherever. I'll have that stability back, thank you. How come there aren't any Timurids in the Timor Sea? It's not the Timur Sea. That and then that, and then pay these off. Very good. Slaughter them. Were the Timurids too timir timid? How do you feel about me? Still doesn't want to be my friend, sadly. Split off the transports. Mill cap. Try and drop these over here. Hello? You should be able to do that. Why can't you go there? What's the deal? It's impossible! Oh no, it's possible to move here with ships. Then do it! Why won't you do it? Auto transport is so buggy. You can hear me. Like, you can hear me clicking. And I'm holding the button. Ugh, whatever, I'll do it manually. Go explore wherever. Well, I've got four regiments less. Not just one. What does exploration really just give us? Nothing that matters. So we'll just get that one and then we can stop. Now it accepts that it can auto-transport. Weird.
Ah, maybe it's a Shinto event and not a Japan event. That could be true too. Nunban trade? Spread of Christianity. Here we go. No, a lot of these seem to have, um, have the events from the DLC in it. Oh, there's one. A break with tradition. Is Japan decided on Christianity flag is not set? A Christian realm is set. Where is that one set? See you, Galgamus. And our boats all died because they're idiots. But hey, we might go encounter Portugal. Now, it honestly doesn't really matter when I get that done, so I might as well do these first. No more love there. Gain the prestige. There we go. Surely that gives us encountered them. No, it looks like a Christian realm is something else. Ugh, well that's painful. Oh well, we'll find out one way or another. And we'll continue with our eat up the uh, CN's plan. Uh, combat width. Combat width, naval morale. Those are the two biggies. Crack Jesus. I also quite like the um, Admiral's level up one because it helps you get more Admiral pips and Admiral pips also let you win battles. And then you just train your Admirals. Um, during peacetime you have your Admirals train on your trade ships. I don't even really need this anymore now. I should probably move my capital back to Japan. 
Oh, no, I don't. Yeah, this isn't needed anymore. So you can go inside our guy. Done. It's amazing how quickly our naval force limit is coming back up. That'll do. Keep trusting down my minions so that they stay loyal. No harm in marrying them either. <laughs> and the Admiral Pips one also helps you earn just the tiniest little bit of money. Um, because your trade ships will be having extra maneuver pips. So during your downtime, while you're training them, crack Jesus, you will, uh... Maneuver pips on your admiral in charge of your trade ships increases their trade power. More trade power generally equals more money. So it helps. It helps with a little bit... A little bit of money. In addition to the combat aspect of having... Having admirals that have combat pips of relevance. Okay, we're next. If we finished this, presumably I can now reach down here. Very good. And then there. Sorry, then there. And then slaughter those natives. Too many more of this to be done. <sighs> if I don't stand down, I risk the chance of my air dying. Which would be really, really not fun. Oh, wow. VJ is no more. Welcome, Madurai. And they aren't even friends with Bahmanis.
Good. And you. Yes. And you. Same deal. But for now, wait for the other one to finish. You can go do that. These ones can become traders. <sighs> Blessed run, we're doing all right. One, two, three, four. We're down to one page of these. Probably worth it to just spam out a bunch of this. go. Get rid of our admin problem. Uh, sorry, mill points problem. They're happy enough to let me yoink. Very good, and then from there, we also want to head as close to over here as we can, approach from both sides. Could you do your job? I told you to get over here and protect trade. Silly boats. There, try again. I'll take the ducats, thank you. And we've paid back our loans from our period of decoring everything. You slaughter this. Good, they're all dead. You slaughter this. Excellent. And then come back home. You need to learn how to play this game? Johnny be good. Down Louisiana, knock off New Orleans. Clergy helps. We wouldn't mind Prestige Man. We're down to a tiny fraction of these left. You. Level up. Which now means these ones can go do their job. Wait, is there nowhere to explore? Ah, not in port. not establish a prison colony yes why not these can train having slaughtered all the natives there's no reason for them to not train same with you
then there were three. Oh, our explorer died mid explore. Mm. I'll wait for this colony and for this colony to finish before I buy a new explorer, because otherwise they sort of don't have naval range on anything particularly significant. And if you want to learn how to play, I can shamelessly self promote and suggest you go to my exclamation mark YouTube in chat channel for a link to the YouTube channel. And there is a series there called. EU4 Academy with the Blobber, which teaches you a bunch of the game basics. Hashtag shameless self promote. In fact, why don't I just provide a link to that series? I don't need to hear my own theme song. Hello and welcome. Alright. Boom! There's a playlist. Hello and welcome to EU4 School. Admittedly, you should probably start with the basic ones rather than the intermediate ones, but whatever. I should probably resort that list. And there were two. And then there's only one more bit of trust he could possibly have anyway. can probably afford to be slower than this one. This one's the one that will let us jump around to Brazil. Uh, I can see Portugal, so I could stop Portugal wanting to eat me and hate me. And we might as well do that preemptively. Certainly doesn't hurt. And then there was only one. Doo -doo -doo -doo. Might as well, everything is. I hate that button. Everything is training. do it a bit differently, come down to the capital, then train. You go back to protecting our trade.
Getting close. We'll have recalled the last thing. Probably send these over to Brazil. Done. Last thing record. Why did we have to record Japan? Because we uncorded Japan in order to be allowed to move our capital into the new world. In order to move our capital over here. Ah, uh, no, that baby isn't good enough. In order to be able to move our capital here so that I can eat the colonial nations of uh, America without Mama Bear, Portugal, Spain, whatnot, getting involved, um, we had to destate everything, so the only thing that was in a state was our capital, and it had to be isolated, so it was moved to here. <laughs> Sorry, Sir Jamo, I'm not quite getting on what you're not quite understanding what you're trying to get at. Give this five months and then they'll be ready to move over to Brazil and start explorificating. Maybe find us one of the seven cities. Oh, those are the three main reasons to recall. Uh, force limit, income, and sometimes you need to have things in full cores and full states before you're allowed to do certain nation formations. Yes. I'd rather the mill points. Neither side gets it. Okay, across to, well, not Brazil yet. I need this colony to finish and us to gain the new trade range over here. But soon, TM. Remarry our minion. They need the last bit of trusting down, and then there's no more trust to be had with them. The game's grumpy pantsing about, You didn't build the marketplace! You said you'd build a marketplace! Turn this back into our center of trade. realize they aren't worthy of being our rival. Let's try and keep them un ungrumpy. Will you let me be your friend now that I have a province somewhat nearby? Almost. And he's rich and he's not entirely crappy in terms of strength so I am willing to be his friend.
the Ottomans already own most of Egypt. And we can finally see that there is an Ethiopia. It just hasn't succeeded at um, gobbling up any of this coast. No, that's trying to trick me. Fight. Do, 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 do. Now, highly trained units mow through the untrained masses of our lesser nobles. and this one will finish. Tempting, but no, we need to start rebalancing our tech. It's going to cost us way, 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 way too much money. So close. He almost wants to be our friend. What about with a couple more units? No. It's my navy strength that he wants higher, not my army strength. My army strength's already at plus 20. Colony finished, so now we should find out if we could reach over here. Whilst that waits, you might as well speed up this one. You go explore over here. You head over here as well. One more. We'll set them across as sets of five instead of six to do the exploring. Be a TC for all I care. Go explore West African coast. So the first guy explores the sea zones, the next guy maps the actual coast. Why didn't you search those ones? And why didn't you search this one? Crazy thing. You failed your mission. You never built the workshop. Uh, the... Trade post, sorry. Yeah, I could colonize South Georgia. Once we find out about it.
That other leader is shit. Good bye to you. Okay, you found out about the South Atlantic. Can you go find out about... The Caribbean? I wonder far, how far north we can reach. Spain, love me. Now he'll be my friend. Some of you, go sit ready for Ainu. I sent them just in time. I can actually see a fair way north. Offer him access. I might as well curry with him. For want of anything else to do. Yep, and then make your way back and then explore the coast of that region. Oh, you've got to go find Bermuda as well. Fair enough. We shouldn't be around to absolutism, so the production efficiency is more useful. Rip. Pull some money out of our backside. You go do the Caribbean coast. And I could reach there. So for the moment we're going to say yes to that. You go explore the Mediterranean. You guys go there, slaughter that, and then you can go explore uh, America. How about you stay along the coast where you don't suffer unnecessary attrition? Yeah, that's slightly too far away. So unless we could convince, like, Noop to sell us a province. Need a bit more money. I'm not going to be able to reach there. You two, there. Kill that, and then come back.
really. Well, that sucks for my boats and my units. I guess we've got to rebuild some. One guy made it back. He is the great survivor. Go explore wherever for you. Go explore wherever for you. There's no level one, guys. And I'm too poor to afford level two. So we don't even try. Well, okay, I can just afford level two. Then come back here and back to training. Very good. And then from here, I could go eat the Caribbean as one of our solutions to not having any Catholic dev. do it again no a third time back to training for all you you who aren't the combat ships please that's not what I intended to do but in any case you who aren't the combat ships head over to I wanted to unselect the stack not delete the stack whoops Move there. You go explore wherever. Now I've got to rebuild that stack. But you know what? I feel like rebuilding it as trade ships. Not quite yet. Okay, split, this guy go explore wherever, oof, I'm gonna sneeze, <coughs> bless me, get your way across to here, and then the same with these. No! Follow the blooming coast! Okay, then sit there and rest for a while. Probably six months. Admin, yes, please.
gather up. See what this does to our trade power. 28 and trade income. 6.3 jumps to. Twenty-eight and six point three, thirty-five and eight. So I'm making one point seven, and I spend less than that on fleet maintenance. So they're definitely a profit maker. These over here as well, please. Okay, and then that can become approaching from this side. Ooh, Zuni is a big boy. Hello, Zuni. Go explore wherever. Go explore wherever. Yes, that gives us the Holy War CB we're going to want against the CNs. Presumably someone else has colonized that province, so they gave up on the mission. doing better than you did. The CNs are really aggressive this... Sorry, not the CNs. The natives are really aggressive this patch, I've noticed. They will try to eat up all of the um, colonial nations if they think they can. They used to be a lot more cowardly and tame. Sadly, we can't auto-explore, which kind of makes life a bit painful for us. What does the Tory tag mean? Sorry? I don't understand the question. Tori means bird in Japanese, but that's only with one eye. Next to the mission flag. Oh, that's the uh, Japanese... You can convert things. I didn't know that this is Tori with double eye. You have provinces you could convert, is what it means. Okay, and that one, although nice, is not as important as this one. You go explore that. You go explore that. No, do that first. Okay, and um, that means it's time to move our real army over to the CNs. So we're going to want a whole bunch more transports. A 
There we go. Why can't you move? Ducats or ducats? I'll take ducats. Uh, lose the legit. Get a new guy. Explore wherever. It looks like the six transports have died on their way over. Yes, it very much does. Try again. So phase one will be moving our Japan units to Cape. And then Cape to up here. And finally across there. Traders. See you, Pisces. Have a lovely day. Step one. Come down to Cape, please. See you, mate. And then, yes. And then what? Probably quantity. Realistically. Cheers, Montura. Thank you for the sub, mate. How are you doing? Come across. You know what? Take a little bit of a rest here. Then continue over. You explore. Go. You explore, go. And they have a little bit of a rest here. Grab the rest of these. Of course we die. One more month's repair for you, and then head up here. Perfect. to Cape. I might as well unlock the extra naval force limit. <clears throat> 25%. Our commitment to our colonial empire has changed the attitude of people to jobs in the colonial administration. No longer a place for freebooters to who seek to maximize their fortune. Instead, it is seen as a career for the brightest and best. This is reflected in our taxes. Explore wherever. Okay, you should be able to head back here. Have a brief break. Do, do, 
Do-do. Say three more months. Cool. From here, you proceed across to our mid-Indian Ocean stopping point. Uh, no. I didn't tell you to hop on that boat. Try again. I wanted you to hop on the other boat and go there. <laughs> go explore. There's nothing else to explore. And I don't really need the prestige from circumnavigating. So these can come home. Similarly with these ones. Go grab all but the very last of these. You come home as well. They're both going to help out our trade ships. Very good. And then you head back down to Cape. And then from Cape... Well, actually, no, you can wait here, realistically. Because it's only this last load of units, and then we're done. Go protect trade here. Go protect trade here. Get ready to merge these. Beautiful. Give them four months, three more months, then head to Cape. You know what? These guys can have their autonomy and we don't care. So to Cape. Cape to here, here to across to here, and we'll eat up Spanish Brazil. Luxembourg? Luxembourg occupies Sierra Leone. The French conquest of Letetsburg. Good, they need their little rest. See if he can make his way up there. And then these ones. And then we're probably good to move these ones as... No, still need two more months. Oh, colony's done. So we want to move down next to Brazil. Okay, and then the last stack. Get your way over here as well. Inflation man is very sensible. Lose the 50 ducats. God damn it, he made us black flag.
Okay, and then there. Let's blow these up. Cross, blow these up. Okay, and then in a handful of months we're ready to go. And begin the great Christianification. Christians are a renewable resource. You can always conquer more. Nicely. <clears throat> okay. No, no, no. Where's my Holy War CV? Thank you. Now we need Spain to be busy. So we wait patiently, or else we check whether he can actually enforce peace. He definitely can. Yes, he definitely can. So we do need to wait for Spain to be busy. Okay, Spain's going to hate us, basically, no matter what now. We can up with the other people, though. Oh, cheers, Irrelevant Welling. What were you playing? I I missed out on your stream. Boo. Boo. What were you playing? I've got a VOD to watch now. Hmm. Portugal could use it as well. In any case, thank you for the raid. Thank you for those of you who are just joining. We are playing... Kirishitian Japan as a speedrun. We started as Hokusawa. We have United Japan. We've moved our capital. Of course, the Japanese capital belongs in Wulna. We've done this so that we can declare war, the holiest of wars, to go acquire ourselves some Christians. Christians are a renewable resource. You can always conquer more. Should you run out of them. Uh, however, in order to do so, we need to wait for Papa Bear Spain, Mama Bear Spain, to be in some other war, so that when we holy war, for example, Catholic Spanish Brazil, Mama Bear Spain doesn't just go, ENFORCE PEACE! And join the war. You continue your exploring. And then if you could try and head that way. This guy died. Grab a new guy. There we go. So yes, we wait patiently for Spain to get into war. The other thing we want to do is probably try and get a colony over here when we can reach it. In fact, even if we can't really afford it, it makes a lot of sense to uh, start that colony right now. Otherwise, it's really hard to land on and control Caribus. Come on. Never has Spain at peace this long. Declare war on some little colonial nation. You know you want to. Some little... 
Like this guy. Do it. We finally caught our admin tech back up. Our admin tech got uh, rather wrecked for a while because we had to recore all of Japan in order to move our capital away. In order to move our capital away, we had to destate everything. And that meant that when we restated everything, we needed to spend a lot of admin on this, as well as moving our capital twice. Once to isolate it and once into the new world. New baby is acceptable. We also get our first policy. Doesn't really help us, but it doesn't hurt either. Liberty desire from subjects. I suppose that does help a little bit, because we have got um, the Philippines. Who needs some more bribery now that I think about it. Portugal does not need some more bribery. Could we go yoink the land again? Yes, we can. Come on, Spain. Whenever do you stay peaceful for this long? Do it! Anyone, Tunis, Morocco, just pull the trigger. Yeah, even Peru. That's the spirit, Sir Jamo. Anyone, get Spain into a war. Preferably a war that will take him more than like a year and a half to resolve. But any war at all to begin with. Failing that, we might move everyone over to do Caribus if they're at war. They're also not at war. Come on, guys. Ah, well, there's part of the explanation. Spain and Portugal are a single, a single entity. So one does not go to war without the other. good. I hate social mobility, but, uh... Hey, Vama. Things are going alright. We took a little bit longer to do the, um, Form Japan than yesterday, but that was expected because we were doing it more stably and more economically... in a more economically responsible way. Yesterday it was, as long as we get over the line and Form Japan before we hit the bankruptcy button, we're fine. Today... We needed to be a fiscally responsible Japan, so it took a little bit longer. Yep, it is. Once once we've done this, we're about, at an estimate, two-thirds of the way through. And I have to say, I am a little bit addicted to Battle Brothers. I, of course, totally didn't stay up till four in the morning playing Battle Brothers off-screen. Off-stream. I wouldn't do that. That would be irresponsible whilst simultaneously watching Baron fail to beat uh, a new a new Illustrajon map in Caesar. Of course I wouldn't do that. I'm a responsible person who goes to bed on time and doesn't stay up all night playing video games and watching watching Twitch. <laughs> it's a lie. I totally did. Uh, so yes, I had a whole bunch of deaths, a whole bunch of um, 
off stream deaths playing Battle Brothers. And, well, I am scared these days of the, um, I don't, I forget what they're called, but they basically look like, um, stone faced monsters and they eat, they eat the dead and then they get bigger. And holy moly, are they scary. Because they also eat their own dead. It isn't just a case of they eat your dead. They eat their own dead. <laughs> Who doesn't get woken up at four in the morning to check on speedruns? Well, as long as I'm not suggesting that you ruin your sleep schedule. I don't have to feel responsible. The next level is in a tactics tech, so I'll take the money saving, because we're actually losing money slowly at the moment. Come on, Spain. Yeah. Nachzechraz. I don't know how you'd actually say it. Nachzechraz. Those things. They're scary. There was like a pack of 14 of them, and total... Party wipe. Rip. A pack of 14 of them in the middle of a dense jungle. So I couldn't run away quickly. And rip. Rip the battle boys. Yep, that'll do. Keeps them busy for a little bit. And then there. And then there. Come on, Spain. Nebuchadnezzars? Oh, they're Nebuchadnezzars. Okay. Well, they certainly get very, uh, very buff when they eat. Eat the dead. They can just straight up eat. One hit KO your, uh, your bros. At least most monsters are <clears throat> polite enough to, you know, actually have to smack you and make you lose health. But these things just have a, like, insta, insta status kill effect. I don't think I've ever seen Spain's. Are you in like a Regency or something? No. Go to war. Ah! Portugal won't be able to defend his Caribus because Port. And then they start a war. <laughs> okay, that looks like a league war also. Look at how many people are in that war. So that war is going to take forever. Let's get eating. Seriously? Why did they both black flag? Ugh, whatever. Come over here. You go get the capital. Auto. Sure, why not? And then let's have a look at how much it is to eat him up. Num 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 Okay, thirty six percent you say
stand on their bodies? <laughs> they can't eat the bodies if you stand on top of them? Okay. When there's 14 of them, it's a bit hard to stand on every body. But I also didn't know it at the time, so... I'm not going to feel bad. Okay, can we just gobble you up? Not quite yet. Soon TM. Done. Goodbye. Thank you, Spanish Brazil. Welcome to being Spanish. No, Japanese Brazil. I only need to call the bits that actually cause overextension. From here, where do we go next? Uh, we probably go to... Caribus. So if you guys could head there, I'm pretty sure I'm going to need a bit of a, a combat fleet, so I guess these need to come over. If you could make your way to here as a starting point, try and keep you sweet on me, you're done. Now, there's no harm in coring the other bits. How is the combat fleet doing? It's halfway here. And across to there. And then we go eat up Caribus. You go fix that. You're going to want a leader. A real leader. Someone is preparing to attack Cusco. Okay, grab those across to Caribus. You come defend the transport fleet because you're clearly combat ships. Wait there first and repair. Give them a couple of couple of months. Okay, these come and guard here. Their job is effectively done. These are all repaired enough. Now, you, you are tasty. Holy war, eat, go.
quickly take over an island so that we can actually supply our ships. like two more months uh, and you can now be this again actually you probably won't get here before that's done so maybe it's better off for you to work down here where you can ensure our access to Spanish La Plata you should be able to drop across to there now there. No, you're fine at this end. You head over to there. didn't think they would actually lose. Okay, that's really embarrassing. <laughs> Sucks to be us. You go get that. You go get the capital. Try this again. Okay, you're across to there. Now, you, I want to eat all of you. Num 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 num. go, 50%. Wait. Once they've grouped back together, then you can send them on. Though, actually, if they walk back into us, that would also be convenient. Now, can I just accept the Catholics? Not yet. Come on. It's four versus two. There's no way we could lose. Thank you. Soon TM. These need to repair. Done. bit of stuff to call. Now can we become Catholic? Not yet. How's our graph look? Is the next question. How does our graph of Catholicness look? Yeah, we're nearly there. 40%. 
If we eat up La Plata, we might well be there. One of these is going to have to stay and fight the... Caribbean Separatists. In fact, three more are going to have to stay. But these can come across to here. Go. Good. Yes, doesn't hurt. Keep coring. Core everything! Very good. And then these ones to there. You're going to have to go guard... Or help. Help, I should say. You're going to have to go help these move around as necessary. I don't think... I'll need my... Well... I'm, I'm making enough money that I don't need to my send my... I was thinking about sending my trade ships back home to uh, Japan. But it's it's utterly unnecessary. Well, that makes eating you un unpleasant. Hmm. And yet... I want to do it. on, how much longer can it possibly take for you to get to that province? Apparently quite a while. We Step one, fix that island. Step two, fix the other island. Thankfully they occurred as separate stacks. How much of you can I eat? <laughs> you aren't occupying any forts, this is true. Go get the capital. You know you can move. Apparently they don't know they can move, so let's combine them. Your job is now to go fix that. Well, they've even started another one whilst we've been going. And then once we've eaten up these, we can do Rio de la Plata. The number of people in the war is getting smaller and smaller. We don't have too long. These are going to be needed over here as well, please. I said move over here as quickly as possible. Kill that. Once this finishes. We failed to complete our Go Boost stability mission. You merge with those. Where are they running to? Lose the dip points. Pick those up. Bring them back quickly. You see if you can capture those guys that were running away. You head over here. See if you'll give in yet. Quite yet. Come 
Come on. Is that enough? Yep. Done. Goodbye. Halt. Because now the time is come to do this guy, unless that makes us Catholic enough that we can click the button. But we can't, so what we do instead is we come over here and we click this button and we hope to turn these into... No. Okay. Not those ones. What about these ones? There we go, we can turn the Spanish La Plata Separatists into some Catholic ones. Beautiful, is that enough to me to turn Catholic? Apparently still not. Really? 45%, it's still not more than 50. Go! Holy War, more. We must have more Catholics. And we'll fix that after. Are you not great... Uh, are you not playing the great start peasant militia? Full of pitchforks and... Uh, I'm playing the normal start. It's just called normal. I don't see any other options than tutorial and normal. I don't know. Maybe you have to win your first campaign before you unlock the others. Or maybe the others are DLC gated. That will also work. I don't need that. I am going to need another place to eat if this is insufficient. We would like... Well, actually, I'll be able to do this. So... You. Holy War. Go. Well, Define beat the tutorial. I got to the end of the bit where they're like... Do this, then do this, then do this. And then it was just like, go out into the world and do whatever you want. So I don't know what counts as um, beating... Finishing the tutorial. Because the tutorial just sort of felt like it f flowed into a standard game. Soon TM. Oh, you've got to do 14, 40, 18, 12, uh, 18, 21 hours. You go get that capital. I won't be able to eat all of it, but I will be able to eat that bit. I don't know how they even have separate land. You've got to go fix that. He's not going to give in until we uh, get that to happen, so you know what? Bring our navy over here, use our cannons. There we go, num num num. Is that enough for us to become Catholic? Still doesn't look like it. 
Come on, that's 50.3. Let me become Catholic. It's the super majority. Maybe it needs to be 51% exactly. We'll see in a sec. Uh, clear that. Come back. Actually, you could all clear to there. You clear that. Whoops. Oh well, we're going to help fight their rebels a little bit. There we go. Actually, even better, we can use our boats to do that quickly. Who needs to walk when you've got boats? Oh god. No, they're stealing the bits that I want. No! Dominant religion. It is dominant. Look at it. If I have to unstate other stuff again, I will. Although there's not really very much left to unstate. I can unstate that. That's not stated anyway. That's not stated anyway. None of that is stated. This has to stay stated in order that I can convert it more quickly. Are there any other states that I can make? You know what? I'm willing to let you out. It's more important to us that we go fix this. And then that. What an ass. Sure, one more province. That's how greedy I am. actually help, because that's a wrong religion province. State everything that we can, try and get it to accept that we are predominantly Catholic. now. Yes! Catholic becomes the new state religion. Accept. Okay. Now we've just got to convert all this crap. That means we need a conversion man. Uh, actually, we'll take stability man temporarily because he helps us stab up and that helps us convert. Uh, no, we start from the bottom and work our way up. Yes, Defender of the Faith would also help. Thank you. Helpful, useful suggestion, chat. From here on, we don't care if this actually defects or not. It doesn't really matter. The purpose of becoming Catholic has been met.
cool. And then these can go over there. What do you and religious do? Morale of armies, don't care. Uh, we were going to stab up. And then once more, and then we were going to search for a conversion man. So where's all this money disappearing? There's a lot in reinforcements. And... Presumably root out corruption is a bit because of no longer being the correct religion. Uh, dip. Yes. Yes. Good, you go get that. These gather up. Go save Caribus. We should start sucking up to the Pope. Even though he can't give you a conversion man these days. They were good days when he could give you a conversion man. Come on. Over here. That, then that. Now, how's this all going? Well, for one, it's going to need more troops over here to suppress some rebels. Convert our capital to Catholic. I agree. This, then these. Good. Boo! Here's slew stab. You guys across to there. Next conversions. Honk, honk, honk. Get out the way. Uh, I should go around and do another layer of dev exploiting because it will make them quicker to convert. Okay, and then those who can't fit that can be the other kind of con dev reduction. And then those who can't even have that can have the other kind of dev reduction. Uh, very probably not yet, Fernheim. That can come once I've done this. There's only so many things I can click on at once. Uh, you, you... Come on. There we go. Uh, you're saying we should go do this, this. We can embrace the Counter-Reformation, why not? Act of Uniformity, sure. Missionary Strength, Missionary Strength, Missionary Strength. Not Tolerance of Heretics. We don't hate the Pope. That's even more missionaries as well. Two more missionaries. Because, you know, Japan was a renowned member of the Counter-Reformation. A renowned member of the Counter-Reformation. You suppress this whole island. Come on. And then 
there, and then here, and then here, and then here, and then here, and then here. <sighs> and then there, and then there, and we're done. Give you a leader. Stab. Okay. Uh, colonize. There, why not? You fix this whole island. Quarantine again. You dock. You explore wherever. Done. And now we want to search for Conversion Man. Oof. Yeah, Catholic does get a lot of those decisions. Uh, none of these are the right things. It's probably time to tell our merchants that they can fund our search for a priest. Come on. I just want a conversion man. You know what? You're technically not useful to me. Go away. <clears throat> you guys, come home. Help us earn money again. The game really doesn't want to give me a conversion, man. It just really, really doesn't. Um... You over to here. though. Ooh, that one's going to take a while. Seat of strong aristocrats. Boo. Boo. We've got to kill our wife. Slash die ourselves. We can help ourselves die by making our king uh, a leader. Nope, no edicts, Fernheim, because we disabled... Uh, mandate of Heaven, so that we wouldn't have to fight Ming in order to get this. It would take like an extra half an hour in order to convince Ming to let me have this. At least based on when we were doing Form Japan as quickly as possible yesterday as one of the daimyos. We literally saved half an hour by not... by turning off Mandate of Heaven and having to not... not needing to fight Ming because 
they don't start guaranteeing this guy as a tributary. I'm willing to throw all our money away at finding a conversion man. Month after month. Yeah, there's no tributary BS. Because we've turned off Mandate of Heaven. Otherwise, what we did the other... What we did in the first time was we attacked Blue Guy here, Pagnunusian. Ming was in that war. Full occupy Pagnusian. Declare the war against... Um, declare the war against... Declare the war against Ryukyu, and then peace out of the other one. And regardless of the fact that Ming didn't want to leave, Pagnuisian wanted to leave because we had control of his um his capital. These two go there. You could fix that. Some of those can go from the top down. We lost our, our stab again. But I want to get rid of the ones that are causing us overextension because they increase our stab cost. Uh, there's no reason for us to not be in the natives love us mode. So we don't get troubled by them ever again. And then those three, and then we're good. Boost, 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 boost as soon as our admin allows. Get ready for the next one of these. Oh, I thought it was at 80, but it was one of the cores that was at 80. Well, more the idiot me. Now, can I core this? Thank you. Come back down to here. Clear out both of those, then come back here. You all merge together. Continue searching for Mr. Conversion Man. Hmm... No. Japan WC speedrun? No. Just... Form Japan as a daimyo and convert everything speedrun. Give me a conversion man game. Yeah, it's probably better off for me if I wait for those three and then click this button. then I'll be able to get the next bit of stability more quickly. Two more months. Come on, give me conversion, man. Hope you owe me stab. Point zero one. That is that is painful.
Paradox just let us pay three times the normal rate and get whatever leader we want. Ugh. I've thrown away about 20 people so far. Like, if I sent out a job application, wants, wants missionaries, and taxmen turn up, frigging execute them. They'd stop turning up unless they actually knew how to convert crap. Thank you. Stab. Alright. Now that progresses at a somewhat more reasonable rate. Instead of 0 0.1, 2.6. Guaranteed normal, not accepted culture. Eh, I can live with that. If you're getting the one you want, maybe it doesn't necessarily get to be the culture you'd want it to be to level it up. Fine. missed one. Kill what? Could you give me some money, please? We've been friends for a long time. I'm sure you owe me some money. Thank you. Okay, and then I want this one. And I want this one. There's about four more sets of conversions to do. The Caribus Separatists once more. are all pretty much the same. Only Issei took noticeably, lo noticeably longer than the rest. Okay, kill. 
Hopefully our leader is enough. Yep, good. Go, 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 go. I should totally be uh, converting the gold mine. Help fix our economy a bit. Twenty percent more goods produced would be quite helpful. Priests, aren't they meant to be waving their hands going? Rrr, rrr. I remember there being little animated conversion people. what we just don't care as long as you don't teleport your way over here we don't care One, two, three, and then we're done. Right? This is all converted. This is converted. Double check the achievement conditions. Step one is Japan. Check. Step two is in the Christian religious group. Check. All provinces in the Japanese region are Christian religious group. 
And once those three are done, it's check, check, check. Cool. The Shinto zealots are nowhere near actually rising up and preventing us from converting. It's all good. We'll do this. I'll have a quick half an hour break for dinner, and then I'll be back with Battle Brothers. <laughs> So now the question becomes, who's online that I can pass people along to until then? Hey, we can throw you along to Pisces for a bit. But let's not get too ahead of ourselves. Done. The Shinto people don't even mind being converted anymore. Zero unrest. Oh, now they've realized that they should want some some of this. You think a 30 minute BRB food screen wouldn't be that? Nah, I don't like doing that. I'd rather throw you along to someone else and if you decide you want to come back, you come back. I'm not a greedy person. I don't need the views. 